It's about the EA College Football 25 Ultimate Team mode. Aaron, do you know anything about Ultimate Team? I don't. Please educate me. So uh, you buy card packs and you get players. You make player. You make teams out of those players. Mm. And um, yeah, and that's it. Mm. Right now, players have different rarities. Like maybe you get like a legendary Quinn Ewers or like a a, a, a common Quinn Ewers. Whatever. Do you it's play? Your, can you like play a season or you play? So there's actually a few different modes this time around. You can play solo seasons where you can play like five game seasons against the AI. Uh, you can play head to head like full seasons, championships, and everything. They have sort of like I've played a lot of Hearthstone, so they have sort of like an arena uh, mode every weekend where you have the weekend. If you get the ten wins without losing two games, you'll get massive prizes. It's also gonna have like a buy in to get in there. Mm -hmm. um, they have things like in Hearthstone we used to call them tavern brawls, where they kind of change the rules. They they reference something called like like each week there'll be like a different set of rules. To, tweak the game right like touchdown tango it's 25 yard first downs and 14 points for a touchdown whatever um but so you 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 get cards of different rarities you create a team uh off the bat one thing that they immediately start talking about that i don't really like um current nfl pros are going to be available in the card packs so because of their deals with the nfl pa um Patrick Mahomes, Joe Burrow, all these guys, Joey Bosa, a lot of your favorite kind of legends are going to be in there. But my immediate reaction is, mm, mm. if I wanted to play with or against Patrick Mahomes or Joe Burrow, wouldn't I just play Madden? Like, isn't the interesting part about this getting to know these would you get, college would players? You, would you get Patrick, like college version Patrick Mahomes? So not yeah, a 99 Patrick Mahomes, yeah, you get Texas and gonna Patrick gonna Mahomes. Suck, but he's not going to suck. I, I, I suck, obviously, but like maybe they go back and use his ratings or what his ratings would have been. I don't know. Maybe, maybe so. They weren't clear on that point. Um, yeah. and, and look, I love card packs. I fucking will get sucked into a card pack like nobody's business. Like I understand. Like that's like my form of gambling. Uh, this I don't love this. Um, mm -hmm. like anything else you could expect you earn coins through challenges and objectives. Then you either buy packs or you can go to the auction house and you can buy like a specific player that you may need. Um, like all that. Uh, but then we get into the chemistry system, which there's 134 team chemistries. There's 19 total offensive and defensive scheme chemistries. You know, if you're building an air raid team, you're going to want players that fit in with the air raid. Same thing if you're building a base four, three defense, blah, blah, blah. Uh, your cards have their rarities, um, uh, but, you know, commons are gray, uncommons are green, rares are blue, epics are purple, legendary gold. I feel like World of Warcraft made this up and nobody ever looked back. Uh, but here's my problem. And it it's, it is highlighted with the chemistry system and everything that that entails. Uh, there are simply too many systems in play. And if you know video games, you know that this is a classic way of making a game pay to win, right? On the surface, it feels like, oh, no, you just buy the card packs. You choose your best players and you plug them in. So, like, if I get lucky with a few good card packs, yeah, sure, then, then look at me. I'm going to be good. But when you get down to the nitty gritty, when you throw in all of these distant mm -hmm. systems, you create little opportunities to min max. So maybe you got a really good Patrick Mahomes, but he doesn't fit in this team as well. And so, well, what if I just spent more money and I got this version of Patrick Mahomes and he would fit even better. And it's, and, and, and so it, I mean, and, and everybody knows this is pay to win. So I'm not like saying anything like uh revelatory here. Um, but I hate the idea that current NFL players are in it. Um, I'm okay with the idea that some legendary all Americans from the past are in it. Uh, but I just hate the systems. Like if you would have just had this as only college players, only one version of each player, no legendary mm. Quinn Ewers versus common Quinn Ewers, only one version of each player, only college players. And you just buy card packs. I would have spent hundreds of dollars on this. Mm -hmm. After reading about this, I have almost no incentive to engage with this at all. Zero, zero. I'm playing, I'm playing dynasty mode, and that's about it, uh, to be honest. And I'm actually gonna buy mine right now. I'm gonna pre have you pre-ordered yours yet? No. No. I need Are to. You going to? I'm going to. I'm obviously going. Well, I'm I'm kind of on the fence about whether or not I want to pre-order it to play early because I'm gonna be at SEC Media Days. 
Yeah, I won't be like I'm not gonna, like I'm, I'm, I'm not, I'm not gonna be able to play for the first few days. It's gonna, we're just absolutely getting fucked by Greg Senke, you fucking bitch. I'm just kidding, Greg. So but do we just I need to buy the standard good. edition then? I don't know. I don't know. Uh, hit us with your question, KT. Um, but yeah, I just wish that this was an opportunity for them to do a strip down. Um, nothing in this game is stripped down. Everything in this game is juiced up. I mean, what yeah, did you expect? Yeah, yeah. I mean, they're, they're, they. No, no. Again, they, again. You you've said from the very beginning that you'd rather have more and then kind of strip it down if you want to. They, that's their mentality. This, they, they're going to give it everything. Th- exactly. So I am at odds with things I've said in the past, but I'm talking specifically in the monetization. Um, and and to be clear, because all creating different rarities of a player is doing, all that's doing is getting more ways to make you pay money. Yeah, and the chemistries 100%. and everything else. It's just giving you more ways to pay money to try to min max, um, and you can min max by either spending a ton of money to buy the specific card you need on the auction house, or spending a ton of money just buying a ton of card packs. Um, so yeah, I mean, and look, but again, I'm not naive. You knew this was coming. I just wasn't sure they'd done everything else so right if they were going to, um, if they were going to maybe make a bold stance and be like, you know what, yeah. we're gonna. We're gonna kind of take this back a little step since since people aren't really coming here for Ultimate Team. Why don't we not make it as insidious and fuck worthy? But whatever, you know, you can't get corporate. You can't get the funding that you want for a game like this unless you show the corporate bigwits. Look, here's how we're going to take advantage of our gamers and get them to mm-hmm. spend all their True. money. 